What's up, you wandering asses? Steph and I are heading down South 55, heading toward New Orleans, and we thought we'd throw out a rut. Raw, uncut thoughts on the road. The one I have today that I want to get on my soapbox a little bit, because we talked about it last night on our live video on YouTube. Uh, we were out there chatting it up with everybody. Thanks for tuning in. We had a lot of fun. And this one is about do you carry? Do you carry a pistol with you while you ride? Do you carry? Where do you carry it? And what do you carry? So three things there. Uh, if you get a chance, you can leave it down there in a the comment. Tell me what you're carrying, where you're carrying it, and if you do carry. A lot of questions come up about this. Uh, Steph and I, we ride coast to coast on this old bike, and we travel from uh, state to state. And in those states, they have different laws. We've talked about this, and we've looked them over. Also, we've noticed, say, if we ride out to California, you actually need to have it in a lock box. We've looked into that as well. And then if you uh, carry it on the bike, of course, you've got it in your saddlebag or maybe somewhere else. Then if you carry it on yourself, where do you carry it? You carry it on your hip? You carry it on your boot? Uh, I've seen a lot of those mid torso belts where you can tuck one in as well that might be an option the other thing what do you carry the little pistol that i really enjoy shooting and steph really enjoys as well is a glock 43 that little nine millimeter it's called compact i really like the glock uh, their looks are something that's grown on me but one thing i do like about them and they're durable you can get them dirty and they'll keep on shooting easy to break down and clean which is always a plus. And a lot of thought has went into this. Steph and I have talked about it over and over. Of course, we get out and camp. And when we're in that old tent, we do sometimes think we might need a little protection, you know? Uh, that's one thought as well. And then the next thing goes to if we are carrying and we get later in the evening, we uh, stop somewhere that may serve alcohol, beverages, then uh, it's illegal to carry that weapon into a bar or eating establish it and then you get over there into the bar and we're always doing that so I don't want to be caught in that place with a pistol and then if you do you want to go put it up and uh, put it in your bike guys I guess lock it up yeah this is what's on my mind this is my rut for this little ride down south 55 like I said, if you'll leave your thoughts in the comments below, we would like to see. Kind of start a conversation maybe with everybody. You might look around on our channel too, the Honorary one here. We have a lot of different videos there. You can uh, look over and see different content. We appreciate you tuning in. If you wouldn't mind, you could hit that subscribe. I'd really enjoy that. It means a lot to Steph and I. Also, you can become a member, and be an Honorary one. That's right, we got three different tiers depending on what you want. It gives you different perks for the honorary one. You can go check that out as well. That's right, guys. We're heading on down here to see some boobies at the Mardi Gras. <laughs> We're gonna go down and have a good time. We'll have a little video coming out as well about our ride down and at Mardi Gras. Thanks for tuning in, guys. We'll see you next time. And like always, you guys stay honorary.